Oof stream. We're gonna hopefully finish off today, but we will see just how long that takes us. YouTube viewers, thanks very much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you like what you see. Also, we're trying to think hard about what game to play next. If you'd like to comment or use the suggestion box on Twitch, please do. It had been too peaceful, so I almost forgot there's something coming to me. I don't know how this server is going to go, but the fact that I'll be working here can be a good sign. I'm just a normal food inspector today, for now at least. to be one.
Big or small, you're responsible for your words. How can you expect a man to tell the truth is even mistaken about where he lives? And trust, well, truth is essential during this whole survey. Can I make myself clear? Yes, sir, of course. 
Okay now, let's get started. Whew. That's a bad start. Alright, Mr. Crawford, we do already have a lot of information about you on hand. Your family, your education, your work experience, your favourite restaurant. We don't really know more about you. So today, let's just talk about you. You don't seem too keen on the topic. Um, I'm sorry, sir. I just have a tiring day at work. It is tiring, isn't it? But still, hundreds of people want to get their foot in the door every year. Sure, I didn't mean to complain at all. So tell me, why exactly did you choose to work as a food inspector instead of something else? For the peak gun. What did I say? I think I said it's for me. Benefits. I'm not noble. I just want to live a better life. thing about you that caught our attention is that you sent almost all your savings to a company called Yorizuya before you went to the skyline. Would you mind explaining it to us? What exactly did you ask Yorizuya to do for you, son? To look after my mother. I paid them to look after my mother from time to time. You know, since I've been working on it. look after your mother? I don't think such a thing would cost much of that much money, does it? Uh, I, uh, it's a pretty long lasting order. I don't know. I don't know the answer to any of these questions. <laughs> Fifteen years, I guess. Fifteen years? Why? Oh, well, people at Eurozoia told me if it's not a temporary thing, I should pay for a long period to get the best rate. Pardon me, son, but now I start to think that you're up to something or just stupid. I can't say I didn't regret it at all, but the deal is sealed. Okay then, thank you for sharing. Okay then, I've learned enough about you today. Let's call it a day. Thank you. Oh my god, am I gonna re Do I have to remember these things? 15 victim, the status benefits. Status benefits victim. We'll resume the survey tomorrow. Now, Some from sleeping, so let's just eat one of these. Can we get some from sleeping? Let's see. Let's hope we do better today. Never expect to see Demi in here, he looks terrible. God, is this server going to last for more than two weeks? Will I end up like him if I can't answer those questions well enough? A passable seat, that's good. Yo, hey. Where's the office? 
person. They'll only come after work now, I suppose. They're, not, they're too busy to care about people like us every morning. So how was yesterday? I have no idea. What did she ask? Something about me. Things like the reason why you wanted to be an inspector. How did you know? Because I started the same way. Yes, there's a fit of procedure or something. Don't know what it is for. Anyway, you be careful. He seems to know things that he's not supposed to. I thought like the things I spoke with only with Elodie. Like the things I spoke only with Elodie. Elodie? A girl working at one of the designated restaurants. I don't know where to go to all that information. Maybe it's Elodie who told them. Anyway, I don't think I did or said anything wrong. I hope they can realise that sooner, that sooner and let me go for the rest of I've had enough of this place. Hey, you okay? Yeah, sorry. Work should start in a minute now. Let's get ready. Attention, it's right over the line. Transportation mode catches. Incoming item number one, mouse. Great colour. That, we have two snare. Mouse one, two snare. 
Rupert, come in. Have a seat. Okay now, before we start, how's work today? Work? Um, it's okay. Okay? A little advice to you, son. Don't use words like okay when you're answering a question. And I'm not just talking about this survey, because okay doesn't mean anything. Such kind of vagueness is only a waste of your time and others. Is that clear? Yes. So let me ask you again. How's work today? Oh, uh, well, I tried my best but still made some mistakes. No, I didn't. I made no mistakes. Good, that's what I'm talking about. Now that you know how to answer a question, let's begin. Interrogation. Today we're going to talk about, well, work. I believe we all know how difficult food inspection is, or can be, and it's a, it is difficult for a reason. The same reason food inspectors are respected and loved by the people. That is, they vowed to keep our food safe and fair. You must have vowed the same thing before joining in, haven't you? Yes, we did it together, the new inspectors. Very well. Here's the, but here's the thing. People say one thing and do another all the time. We understand if one became an, an inspector purely for its benefit, but breaking the vow is an entirely different matter. You may not know, but it's still happening every now and then. What's still happening? Stealing and smuggling, son. Two things that can destroy the city. This city we save from the chaos of the Great Famine with sweat and blood. Certainly, sir. So my question is, what do you suggest we do with those people? They should be punished hard, they deserve a second chance, or... I don't know. Um... They should be punished hard. I think they should be punished hard for what they did. Didn't expect to hear something like that from you. After all, you were once a victim. My father got what he deserved. The first lesson we learned at school, law is higher than blood. Isn't it, sir? Hmm, very well. You know, hardly do we accept people with your background as government workers. But I still, st but I start to understand why they let you pass. I'm grateful. Okay, next question. So you may have wondered why we kept hiring food inspectors these past few years. Well, that's mainly because we are losing them at pretty much the same pace. For all sorts of reasons, good or bad. But we've been trying to fix it. Lately, the conditions of Skyland have been greatly improved, for instance. And this server is also collecting data for that purpose. Anyway, what we want to know is... What's your career goal or future plan as a food inspector? I want to treat inspection as a lifelong career. I want to join the government ministry in the future. I don't have a plan right now. Um... He says we wanted the status, so um, I don't know, maybe let's join the government ministry. Job hopping. I want to join the government ministry in the future. Oh, you do? The Ministry of Honour may be a good fit for you. I can't share too much with you, but if you're interested in the status or fame, you'll learn a lot how, about how that works there. Thank you, I'll think about it. Although sometimes you probably don't want to get too close to the things you love. You'll know what I mean when you spend some more time up there. Okay, a bit short, but that's all for today. We'll continue tomorrow. Probably some personal questions, some more personal questions. We'll see. Now you may leave the room. Thank you. Where's the shelf gone? There. <laughs> Go to bed. I see what they're trying to do with the survey, but one thing's for sure, it's not just a normal survey. In fact, everything seems to be the opposite of normal. The food we checked, the people they bought here, me, Demian, Alan, and even this room itself. If we can really call it that instead of a cell. And more importantly, they clearly know how easily we can sneak food out from work. Did they already find out what I've done? It's kind of Demian. The government seems like they have talking to delivery staff. What have I said to the delivery staff? I gave one of them the map. Oh no. Um, why are you 
so interested in my server. You know why? I don't think I do. Fine. It's killing me there. I just want to know if I did anything wrong. I mean, if I did everything right, so there's no reason to keep me, right? Right, but it's a survey, not an exam. My answer doesn't necessarily work for you. I know, just tell me. Should you tell them everything with complete honesty? Yes, of course. I've nothing to hide from you. No. I sometimes choose to hold something back. But maybe that's exactly what they care about, the sincerity. You're right. Yes, I should be more frank with them as well. Alright, let's focus on today's work. I don't know what boost is. Transportation is on 049. Transportation mode non-stop. Okay, brace ourselves. Behind I some pig heads. Red stamp.
Well, well, well. You two are you really getting me on, aren't you? I hope there isn't some evil plan going on. Save it for tomorrow, you can do Please come and support us. Bye then. Yeah. Rupert, come in. You don't have to wait for an order to sit down, son. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, now. After two days, I should be able to say I know now know you are a little bit better. I now know you a little bit better. That is, if you've been frank with me. Of course, sir. Then keep it that way, because this survey is going to be in your record forever. Duly noted. Very well. Today, I'll be asking you some more personal questions. You may choose not to answer if it makes you feel uncomfortable. Let's begin. Firstly, let's talk about the case, shall we? Benjamin Crawford, your father, arrested and put on trial in 2021 for smuggling, fraud, crime and treason. You might have been asked about this before, but what do you think or feel about your father's case now? Like I said many times before, he got what he deserved. That's all. Don't you feel sad or angry? I did. A child lost his father overnight after all. But when I grew up and I read about what happened, I was somewhat relieved. You must have had a hard time with your peers, eh? Yeah, can't deny it, but I wasn't that sociable anyway. I was too busy making a living. I see. You were working at one of the manufacturing factories of Foxconn, eh? Yes. And just around that time, your mother got sick and was moved to the care centre. And then? Well, this record doesn't say much about your mother's illness. What happened to her? I've been told it's food poisoning. Probably some milk she drank, they said. Hmm, that explains a lot. So the government is covering all her expenses, I suppose. Yeah, I could never afford it myself. I see. After what happened to your father and now this, how did you feel? I was devastated. I was devastated and angry. I felt nothing. I don't want to talk about it. Um, let's be an emotionless vo void. Ah, uh, let's just be devastated. Oh, I don't know. Um... Devastated. I was devastated and uh, I don't know how to put it into words. That's enough then, my son. Sorry. But please forgive me for asking this. Under what that kind of situation, why did you still choose to work as a food inspector that would make you unable to see her for months? For the status. That wasn't an easy decision to make. You probably don't know, sir. My mum, she fell in a deep coma soon after she was taken to the care centre. The doctor said there's a high chance she'll never wake up again. Then I realised. You realised what? If I could ever become an inspector, at least I could get the status I wanted for so long. Hmm. Well, I'm not surprised. After all, you don't get the chance to be a food inspector every day. Hmm. Okay. Now, my last question for today. It's going to be a tough one, but also an important one. Oh, yay. So my suggestion is that you should give a clear answer, no do dodging, no hiding. So, okay, so the question is, is your father's, if your father's still here today and you're the only one who knows what he did and all those crimes he committed, what would you do? Report him immediately, ask him to give himself up, refuse to answer. Let's um, report him immediately. I would report him immediately. You'll report your father? Doesn't matter who he is to me, does it? No, it doesn't. Just to make sure you know. Well then, I think that concludes our survey today. Pretty heavy questions, eh? Get some good rest tonight. You may leave now. Yes, sir. Wow, these days are intense. doing okay actually cool um let's end the part there and we will be back for the next part very soon
keep watching guys thanks very much